Hey everyone, welcome back to Sebrov. In this video, I will be explaining that how to monitor frame rate in any game and how you can show in-game FPS, CPU usage, GPU usage and the RAM usage. As you can see on the very left and top, you can see all these stats and this stat will be working for all the game. Right now, I am on my Valorant and if I go back and open my Overwatch game, so you can see that on my overwatch also i am getting these all stats like gpu usage what kind of fps i am getting and the ram usage so this will be working for all the game whichever game you play you can notice and monitor the stat for any game so how you have to do that let's quickly explain you so here we will be using a trusted website that is msi afterburner which is safe secure a very good software to just show the stat of any game to monitor your GPU, your FPS and uh, many other things. Now before that I would like to show that if I open my one of the game that is Valorant. So you can see there is no kind of a stat on the left and top. So I will just minimize it. Let's what you have to do here. You have to come to this page. The link will be in the description. And here you have to click on download after burner. This is absolutely free. So click on it. And once it will be downloaded, you will see this zip file. So you need a WinRAR to just unzip this. And once you come here, right click on it, choose extract files. Then you can choose the destination wherever you want to extract. Then click on OK. So once the setup comes up, you have to click on it. Then you will see the setup file. Double click on it. Then click on Yes then click on ok next accept the agreement hit next and make sure that this option of river tuner statistic server has been checked you should not uncheck it okay it should always be checked then click on next next and then hit on install now the installer language will be coming up click on ok then click on yes then hit on next again i accept the agreement hit next so you will be getting two wizard so just follow the step for both of them hit next again again install so once done click on finish then hit finish again and you will be getting the msi afterburner page here so here on the left hand side you will see the setting gear icon click on it then you will see msi afterburner properties and from the top in menu option click on monitoring okay so this is what we exactly we have to work here so you can see different stat here like gpu temperature gpu usage memory usage then we have uh, cpu and memory clock and if you scroll down you will find many more things like frame rate ram usage so this all the stat depend on you that what all you need okay so for example if i need gpu temperature so i will click on it and select it and then below you will find gpu temperature graph property so you have to check this option show on the screen display okay then let's say i want to show memory usage i will click on it and check this option okay so to enable it to show on the screen you have to check this option and now i will come to cpu temperature and check this option and let's say i also want the fps so i will check the frame rate and then check this option all right once you are done click on apply there are many more things like you can change the color that you can just do it yourself and then click on apply and then click on ok now it says a restart is required and as soon as I restart the game so let me show you after restarting that how it works. So the game has now been restarted so let me quickly launch my Valorant let me log in. So the game is now coming up. So once the game come up what you have to do you just need to minimize it and launch your msi afterburner that you have just installed open it then hit on yes 
and now you can minimize it and again if you open your game so you will see the stat on the very left and top it says gpu that we enable then the memory the cpu and the fps i'm getting 144 fps so if you want a better video that how to increase the fps on your valorant or any other game then let me know in the comment section so that's all guys for today hopefully this will video will help you to show the and monitor the frame rate or any kind of a stat on any game played on the pc and if this was helpful for you guys please consider subscribing to the channel like the video and let me know if you have any doubt in the comment section till then take care bye bye